All right, let's take a look at Tyrese Halliburton from January the 3rd against the Toronto Raptors. He is a very good off-the-ball defender, always trying to get into passing lanes, does so by always staying on his toes and having great awareness of where his man is. Here he takes a look at Trent, who's on the top of the key, and does jump this lane. Siakam takes the shot, but if Siakam's making this pass over to Van Vliet, Tyrese is going to pick this ball up rather easily. So excellent work there. And here he's going to drive the seam. And one of his few weaknesses as a player is that he's not a good finisher going towards the rim, tends to pick up his dribble a little early. And here he is, the only man back on defense, gets the steal, gets it up to Buddy Heel. Now watch this pass, kicking it back out to Heel for that corner jumper that does not go down but that's really nice subtle creativity now he's going to get this kick out pass quick left to right crossover Siakam cuts off the drive but Halliburton able to make that mid-range shot it's a shot that he's really improved on in his uh, young career another pull-up jumper from the mid-range that doesn't go down and then more passing lane defense here he's going to pick this pass up and he's going to gather the ball there now does he take an extra step referees tend not to call this because you really don't know when the true gather was gather could have been an extra step, but that's very close on the replay. Now Halliburton is going to rack up a lot of assists on shots like this, where he's going to find open teammates for catch and shoot opportunities, or he's going to hit Buddy Heald, who makes a lot of tough contested shots off movement, although that one doesn't go down. But Halliburton does have the ability to use his eyes, to use his creativity to pass his teammates open. That is just a really good look. He's going to fake the pass to the left and then use his eyes to ward off Van Vliet. There's the pass to the left. He's going to fake and then he uses his eyes to pick up Van Vliet and hit Turner at the basket. And now moving along in this game, here's a transition opportunity where he's going to pry a little bit and then eventually hit Turner, who's going to use good dexterity to head fake and finish at the basket. And here's a little head fake and then sidestep to his right. This is a shot that he didn't have coming out of college. So excellent player development in that regard. But he's going to get this one at the end of the shot clock. And that shot he doesn't have in his bag at this point in his career. And this is a lovely hit ahead pass. And Neesmith who uses the Euro to finish with the left hand. The broadcast actually missed this one. And he's going to ISO Van Vliet, cross over to his right, and he's going to use his length to shoot over him. That shot does look a little bit higher in the mid-range, so he does vary his shooting motion up a little bit. Now, this catch-and-shoot opportunity, not much that Halliburton's doing there to get his teammate open, but on this play, in transition, he's going to get a couple of feet in the paint and then kicks it out to Buddy Heald for the wide-open corner shot. And this one is a money look for Buddy Heald, who has been just really fabulous all season long as a shooter. And a nice little dribble-ahead move by Halliburton who gets himself all the way to the basket and finishes with the scoop right hand finish and then here the Raptors are going to bracket Halliburton really well the spacing is not great and he's got a tough cross court pass to make and Trent does a good job picking this off but Miles Turner able to come back and make that block and then Matherin hits it ahead to Halliburton who makes a great catch with the ball I mean, that is just elite hands by Halliburton who gets it back to Matherin who draws the foul late in the second quarter and then to the third quarter where Halliburton is going to drive to his left and an OG and an OB able to get his big paws in the way get that steal then a little bounce pass to Miles Turner rolling to the basket who's unable to finish and on this pick and roll opportunity I really want Scotty Barnes to press up against Halliburton just giving him that floater which is playing right into the hands of Halliburton who puts it down and then Halliburton's going to take this pass on the give and go and he's going to get into this floater again and he's going to call for a travel and he's going to see that little hop step you got to come down on two feet comes down on one so that's a good call by the referee it, turnovers were a problem throughout the game. Halliburton had seven of them. Here's another one just dribbling the ball off his leg out of bounds. Uncharacteristically high amount of turnovers to go along with the eight assists. And a, another opportunity for Halliburton here where the Raptors are going to miscommunicate, giving Halliburton a wide open look from three. This one doesn't go down. And then just beats Van Vliet off the dribble. Gets into the paint, but picks his dribble up a little bit too soon. Takes off from too far away. Not able to draw the foul. Not able to finish it. That's a problem that Halliburton had a few occasions on the night in this one he's going to do a good job of getting through this screen that's a lot of space for Gary Trent but gets through it and gets a nice lefty on righty shot contest good work on the defensive end by Halliburton and here's a couple of rough clips back to back Halliburton's going to get pressed up nicely by Van Vliet and then OG Ananobi gets his hand in there again and then a nice one-on-one -on -one opportunity against Precious Achua not able to get much of a separation not able to get an angle and Achua blocks it out of bounds 
And then a nice little roll reversal as Buddy Heald gets into the paint, kicks it out to Halliburton who makes that three-point shot late in the fourth quarter. And then Halliburton gets a little running start to the basket, but doesn't quite get that angle and misses it off the backboard. And then here's another occasion where Halliburton's going to get a step, pick up his dribble way too soon, which causes him to take a layup from farther out than I think he anticipated and then doesn't draw the foul. So a couple of uh, missed opportunities there in the second half. But then Halliburton finishes the game late in the game by getting past Van Vliet, getting into the paint, kicks it to Turner for the finish, and then a few plays later, gets into the paint again, kicks it out to Buddy Heald wide open from that right corner who puts it down. Nice work by Tyrese Halliburton in the fourth quarter. He's on his way to an all-star NBA season.